So today I'm going to make some three pepper chicken, or I'm going to attempt to. I've not made it before. I am basing this off of the Arby's three pepper sauce because I really like that, but I don't like it being really spicy and it has jalapenos in it. Uh, based on the ingredient list that I looked up online. Um, so I'm adjusting it to how I like it. And so let's see how this turns out. I'm letting my pan heat up some right now. I'm going to go ahead and add some olive oil. Get it coated good there. I'm going to add in a couple of heaping spoons of minced garlic. Again, I cheat and I use the pre-minced garlic. And you can use anything you want. You can use garlic powder, fresh garlic, whatever you like. This is just what I'm using. And I'm going to add one diced up bell pepper. I'm going to let that cook for a few minutes. I'm basically going to let it cook until it softens up just a little bit. I'm also going to add some um, dried minced onion. Probably about two tablespoons. You can add how much or however little you like. I'm going to add me just a tiny splash of apple cider vinegar to that. I don't want a whole lot in it. And just a tiny little bit of brown sugar. I'm 
maybe between half a teaspoon to a teaspoon of that. drops of some liquid smoke. celery seed maybe about half a teaspoon in some paprika, maybe about a teaspoon, teaspoon and a half, add it to your preference. And I'm going to add some black pepper, again to your preference. I really like black pepper, so. And then I'm going to add about three tablespoons or about three ounces of tomato paste. I'm going to add some water. Starting with maybe about a quarter of a cup of water because you can always add more. Add about another quarter of a cup. Getting this all over me. Probably added about three quarters to a cup of water in here so far. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put three chicken breasts in here. I think next time I would cook the chicken breast with the peppers, but I think this will be fine because I'm going to let it come to a boil and simmer. 
and so it should cook and they'll be fine they just won't have that caramelization on it let's see how this turns out I think I'm going to add about another half a cup of water. Okay, probably a little bit more water. I think I have about two to two and a half cups of water in here so far. I'm going to bring this to a boil and I'm going to let the water cook down. And I think what I'm going to end up with is probably a like a three pepper chicken stew that I can put over some rice. So we'll see what we come up with. Again, I've never made this before. Um, so we're just going to see how it turns out and I'll show you the finished product. All right, here is our finished product. I'm going to plate it up and I'll show you here in just a minute. All right, here we are. And this is our final product. I think it goes great over rice. I tried it. It actually turned out really well. It's definitely a recipe I want to work on to get it perfected to how I like it. But again, it's the very first time I've made it, so I definitely want some suggestions on how you guys would uh, change it. Um, I think what I would do is I would cook the chicken with the peppers uh, next time just to get some caramelization. And I want to adjust my seasoning some, but I'm not sure how. But again, this actually turned out really good in itself. So, leave some comments and tell me what you guys think on what you would do to change it and adjust it. Um, so, I hope you like, enjoy, and we'll see you in the next one. So, don't forget to leave a comment and share. And thank you. Bye.